What is up, Phenomenal fans? I am back at it again with another video. This one, another episode of WWE Breaking News, where I discuss and put my reactions to all of the breaking news going around the world of WWE. Today, another dose of breaking news. This is episode number three for WWE Breaking News. Today, it is official coming up 2019, actually. See, this is flying by way too fast. Less than three weeks till the biggest event for WWE, the grandest stage of them all, the biggest event of the year for the WWE, WrestleMania 34 coming up. Daniel Bryan has been cleared by WWE doctors. For those of you don't, who don't know, Daniel Bryan in his career has been dealing with concussions back in 2014. WrestleMania 30, he had his huge triumphant win for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship back when he defeated Randy Orton and Batista in a triple threat match. But she also defeated Triple H earlier on the night. Then he continued on, but then he got injured. He was dealing with a bunch of concussion problems. So he had to vacate the championship due to, you know, legitimate co lots of concussion problems. He had to vacate the championship. He was gone for a while. Then he finally came back. You know, the WrestleMania after he won the Intercontinental Championship, joining WWE's Grand Slam at WrestleMania 31. But then got injured again. More concussions happened happened he had to vacate the intercontinental championship then after a while come february was it february come a couple years ago unfortunately one of the most beloved wwe superstars of all time daniel bryan was forced to retire from in-ring competition but in this case his regular doctors did clear him but wwe's doctors would not clear him but then the breaking news today WWE's doctors have cleared Daniel Bryan to return to in-ring competition. He no longer is retired. Well, storyline-wise, he probably is. But they'll have... Again, tonight, Daniel Bryan. Tonight on SmackDown Live, Daniel Bryan is set to come back. Shane McMahon took his indefinite leave of absence. Storyline-wise, he took his indefinite leave of absence. And then he got brutally attacked by Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn. Now tonight, Daniel Bryan's supposed to come back to fulfill his general manager role. He, he general manager, not for long. So, this is two things. They're probably going to be setting up for Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn versus Shane McMahon and Daniel Bryan, which, alright, I don't really care what the match is. Daniel Bryan is wrestling at WrestleMania, so I don't care what it is. I don't care if it's Owens and Zayn versus Shane McMahon and Daniel Bryan. I don't care if it's Daniel Bryan versus Shane McMahon. I don't care if Daniel, Daniel Bryan versus Aiden English. Daniel Bryan's wrestling, that's all that matters. It is amazing. They're probably going to set up because Owens and Zayn attack Shane. They're probably setting up for... Owens and Zayn, you know, May McMahon will come back. He'll team with Daniel Bryan for a big tag team match at WrestleMania. Or they could have Owens, because they're technically Owens and Zayn is already happening, but yeah, it's not lasting long. But they might continue that out, maybe turn Owens and Zayn again. I mean, that is what I predicted for is for an Owens and Zayn match. They might continue with Owens and Zayn, and then we might get the match that I more am preferring of Daniel Bryan versus Shane McMahon. That'd be cool to have, because, you know... Don't build, this is what I was saying for a while, don't build up what you can't do. They've been building up for the longest time ever since December of last year, maybe even a little before, probably a little before, but started getting on, um, like last year, December, at Clash of Champions of Daniel Bryan versus Shane McMahon at WrestleMania. At that time, of course, Daniel Bryan was still not cleared, but now that he's cleared, we can finally get them because they've been building towards it with McMahon and Bryan arguing over the Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn over AJ, when AJ Styles was the WWE Champion. One would make a move that the other didn't like. They wouldn't like it. they disagree on it. Bryan would inadvertently, I don't know, help Owens and Zayn get title matches, win their matches against AJ Styles. Shane McMahon would try to screw over Owens and Zayn. Bryan would try to be fair, thus giving Owens and Zayn some matches unintentionally, sort of like costing styles, which McMahon didn't like. He's been like, you know, dethroning McMahon's choices of trying to get Owens and Zayn fired, which then we can finally see the commissioner versus the general manager, Shane McMahon versus Daniel Bryan. That is, storyline-wise, that should happen. Owens and Zayn can find a reason to hate each other again. They can face each other. That'd be a really good match. We all know how they could do in the ring. And then McMahon and Bryan, God, no, God knows what they can do. Because I know we would rather see Daniel Bryan versus Shane McMahon one-on-one. -on -one, I don't know. Loser loses power. And then McMahon will win. And then Bryan come back to being an active wrestler. I'd like to see he's only about like 32 or something. He's, I mean, he was in his prime. Then he had to retire. So 
get back to your prime. And you know, you can be an actual SmackDown wrestler, bring a lot more entertainment to SmackDown. Maybe Shane can find a new general manager. And then Brian, maybe Teddy Long, holla holla playa. I don't know. He can find a new general manager. Daniel Bryan can actually wrestle. So, this has been WWE Breaking News. If you would like the fact that Daniel Bryan is now medically cleared, because WWE, you know, the actual WWE.com and stuff, are putting it on social media, that Daniel Bryan is cleared, smash the like button with a flying knee. Because I'm going to start doing that now with a flying knee, Daniel Bryan. Just to think of this, Daniel Bryan in the ring versus Shane McMahon, or even the tag team match, I don't care. Daniel Bryan, we will be seeing him. It's obviously going to be seeing him at WrestleMania. We will be seeing Daniel Bryan in his trunks, his knee pads, his kick pads, or kick starts, or I don't care what they're called. I'm not a wrestler. I wouldn't know. His boots. Going to lace up them boots. Instead of Daniel Bryan coming out in a suit and tie, making matches, disagreeing with his, you know, general manager owner, commissioner owner. See, I just got out of school, and today is not my day, but Daniel Bryan has made my day because he is now cleared, so I thank you all for watching. If you did like this video, if you did like this video, like this video, I am just not in it today. If you like this video, smash the like button, comment your thoughts on Daniel Bryan coming back. Check out all my other videos and reactions towards WWE breaking news, like Ricochet and War Machine signing to the WWE, like Enzo Amore being released, now like Daniel Bryan being medically cleared. Smash the like button, leave a comment, share with your friends, and subscribe for more.